Mr. Jordan. Good Hello. <laughs> Lovely yep. to see you, sir. Thank you. We're doing well with the chess, aren't we, this week? We're making lots of progress now. We've got a new set of problems today. We do. This looks way more complicated, sir. I like the look of this. Yeah, we've got lots of pieces on the board this time. Now, it is Black's move. OK. Black has got a problem to deal with. Can you see... That's, this is a hard question. Can you see Black's big problem to sort yeah. out? I see an immediate issue. I wonder if the children at home could pause and work out what the issue is. Now that they've paused and, and thought about it, there is a serious issue for the blacks, isn't there? That their queen, the most important piece, well, I guess apart from the king, but the most valuable piece to play with is in direct threat by the white bishop. Well done. Well done, children, if you saw that. Yeah, unless, unless Black does something about it and that bishop takes that queen, then Black's in big trouble. Now, the queen could move away. We've, we've learned how to do that. Yeah. However, sometimes there's a, a, a better way, depending on the game situation. Yeah. Could, first of all, could Black take that bishop? Black could take the bishop, okay, and that might seem really tempting, but there's a problem with taking the bishop, which is if black went all the way down, because it is black's turn, right? Yeah. So if black went diagonally down with the queen, what? take the bishop. So which, yeah, that's the queen. Which piece are we talking about? The Mr. one you're on now, that queen there. Oh, the queen. So yeah. the queen could take it. It could. However. So you'd, you'd think that was good, but then... The white queen is just going to take that queen. And all you've done is you've lost your queen. Yeah, you've taken their bishop, but the bishop's worth three and the queen's worth nine. So that is not a clever move. Don't just attack for the sake of attacking, right? That's that's a really helpful thing to think about, isn't it? So the bishop could, uh, the queen could move away. Yeah. Not good to take the bishop, but there is a, there's an other way that the black... Well, team can stop that bishop can, taking the queen. Can I say why it's a bad reason to move the queen, sir? Because if we move the queen anywhere, sure, the queen is safe, but then that bishop is just going to take the rook. Ah, oh, I didn't see that. That's yeah. a very good point. Yeah, yeah the so bishop would I think moving the queen would be a bit silly because a rook is still a very important piece. Yeah. Ah, oh, well spotted. So, do we tell the children how to defend the queen without moving it, or do we... Well, should we see if they can work it out? Have a little pause? Yeah, that would be great. So now that they've paused, sir, the thing I'm going to do, I obviously don't want to move my king anywhere. I can see that knight next to the rook in the top corner. That one? Yeah, it's got, uh, well, it's got two places it could, well, it's got three places it could move to. But I think what I would do is I would, it could go there. Yeah, it could go there. But I think at the last place I would move to. So if you go two down and one to the side to the, to the left. Yeah, I'd go there because it, the bishop is now blocking that queen. And if the bishop did go and attack that knight, which it could do, well, then you would use the queen to take out the bishop, and that's just a waste of money, isn't it? Yeah, the knight's blocking it. Yeah, and what you're saying is, sure, the bishop can take the knight, but that's only worth three, and the queen could then take the bishop. That's worth three, so the black's all right. It's not right. lost anything. Yeah, not lost anything. That's a good, that's good. Super. Ready for Actually, another I'll tell you what, that's pretty good now because that queen can, is, is threatening the rook as well and it's got it into the board and now we've gone from what was quite a scary position into a really good attackable position. Yep, yep, I like that. There's a lot in that one. Try, are you ready to try another one? I'd love to. Right, Mr. Jordan, here we are. So here's another position. Oh, it's yep. looking a bit complex as well, isn't it? Now, so, whose move is it? It's Black's move again. And again, black's in trouble. Can you see which black piece is under threat? It took me a minute there, but yes, I can see. Maybe the children could pause and work out which black, important black piece is under threat. Pause. Yeah. yeah. Right, now they're back, sir. I can see that the black queen is directly threatened. Are you telling me it's white's go or black's go? I can't remember. What did you say? It's black's go. Black's go, right. To, to try and escape the problem. There's, yeah, you found the problem. That's the problem, isn't it? Yeah. 
And so, black could go on the attack and, and they could send their queen down to take out that bishop, uh, that rook, sorry. But the rook next to it would just eat it up straight away. And to be honest, I don't think it's worth taking out a rook just to lose your queen because that queen is way too important. Yeah, well done. And the queen can't escape anywhere else, can it? There's uh, only one other square it can move to. Good point. If it did go to the right, then it would be under attack by the bishop, wouldn't it? It would. Ah, gosh, that queen is really in a bit of a tricky situation. Wherever it goes, um, it's going to be taken next turn. We're going to have to do a defensive move here, I think. Yeah, and I think there's only one piece that can block this yeah. attack. I, I think, think there's only one it. piece. Let's see if the children can find that move, that one piece that can move. Pause. Okay, I think they might have worked it out if they spent long enough, but it isn't obvious. There is an available knight, isn't there? This one? Well, that one could move, but it's not going to get close enough to the queen to be of much use. I'm thinking of that other knight. Right. Just here. Um, and we know that knights go too uh, ahead and one to the side. So we could move that two to the left and one down. And then it has blocked any potential attack from the uh, rook. And if the rook did want to attack that knight, which it might do, um, then it would be a little bit of a silly move because the pawn or even the queen would take it out, wouldn't it? Yeah. So you, yeah. yeah. So right. that seems like that's what I would do. Is Would you do something silly, similar? Definitely. I think that's the only, I think you found it. I think that's the only way to save the queen. Brilliant. Brilliant. Well done. Time for one more. Yes, I like these. These are a good challenge. Right, Mr. Jordan, well done. Ooh. So here's the third one for today. Brilliant. Again, yep. looks a little bit complicated. Now, whose move is it? Uh, it's White's move. Oh, Again, you. Go on, White's got a problem. White has got a problem uh, because that queen is um, under threat. Uh, is that the position that we're talking about? So that's what I would be worried about if I was white. It must be. That that rook could just take it. Yeah, I mean, it would be a suicide attack by the rook, wouldn't it? Because if the rook did go and take out the queen, it would just get eaten up straight away. But, I mean, you, you want to keep your queen, don't you? You do. So, the queen is like the last one. The queen can't get out of the way. If it goes there... Yeah. the black queen will take it mm -hmm. it goes there the bishop will take it along that diagonal yeah so it's the same thing the queen's trapped unless it can be blocked well, we need to do something about it well it it can be blocked i have spotted something to block it i was wondering maybe once again if the children could have a little go at working out how can we block that queen from attacking if we're the white player pause so the thing I see, sir, is that a bishop is available to block. Am I right? You're right, yeah, because these rooks can't help. These yeah. pawns can't get there. Nope. The king can't get there. Nope. So you move this over here. Yeah, Go and I've got to say, it, it might be a, a, a suicide move, but I don't know. If, if I was black, I don't think I would now attack that bishop. Because the bishop is worth three, so the blacks won three, but what would you do now? Well, I'd, I'd use my queen and I'd take him out because that, that rook is not defended. So that would have been a really silly move. We've, we've got five and they've um, only got three. Yeah. And now look at that. Two rooks and a queen. You are in a way more powerful position. In fact, that yeah. game is going to be won by the whites, isn't it? Looks like it from here. Yeah, they're great. Yeah. They're doing really well. Whoa, I think I've learned a lot today, Mr. Jordan. Well done. Thank you for helping me. That was and I great. Think next, we're moving on to a whole new section where we're going to be attacking and capturing with pawns, I think, is the next thing. Excellent. Love it. We're learning a lot, aren't we? I know. Yeah, I'm enjoying this. Brilliant. Can't wait for the next lesson. Good. Thanks, Mr. Jordan. All the best. See you. Bye bye. Bye.